Hey everybody. Um, so for my rock star hairstyle, I had curled my hair last night and then went to sleep. So I'm just gonna brush it. I'm gonna do like um a mohawk, kinda. I don't really have like mohawky hair, but yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna do like a mohawk style, and I'm going to take. Probably about right where your indentions would be to the side right here. I'm going to take my fingers and just go straight back into like a V. To like the back. It's like right here. Like the... I don't remember what that's called. But back there. I'm going to take the clip. And clip that up. And then I'm going to take the rest of my hair. And take from right behind your ears, you're going to go just straight up. Now that looks kind of crazy. Straight up and then brush that hair back. And you're going to leave these, just put them in front of your ears. And then I'm going to actually turn around and show you, you're going to need a few a little elastic browns. I chose brown because it's my hair color. You want to get kind of closest to your hair color. Oh, let me find it. I'm going to use a clip for this too. So I'm going to take a section about two, three inches, just like a little part, and put that in a ponytail. Like that. And then I'm going to take about three more inches, two to three more inches up. <clears throat> and then put that one, smooth it out real good. And then put that one right above the last one. So it's gonna look like that, but it's gonna be, it's gonna look like a mohawk going down. And so, I'm gonna do that with keeping this hair that we parted to like, where that little bump in the back of your head is. And then I'm gonna put two more ponytails in. Do the same thing that I did before. And then, well, not two ponytails, one. Just do one. So you have one left out. And then you're going to take this hair that we pulled out from behind our ears and spray a little hairspray. I just have, like, this cheap ray of hairspray. And smooth it out. And then you're going to take it. And smooth it back and pulling it into a ponytail so that hair that we had left out for the last ponytail this is the hair that we just pulled up from right here and then we're gonna take the last ponytail and pull that tight together so it's like in a mohawk Look, but you want to make sure that 
you're pulling it real tight so your corners sorry so your corners are real tight because you want it to kind of look like you have no hair on the sides so when you turn to the side it's going to look like kind of like it's stacked on top of each other like a mohawk would be instead of sticking straight out we're going to let it come you don't have to have your hair curly I had curled it last night so I'm just going to wear it curly but that's just I don't know I don't feel like straight enough and I think it looks cute curly and then take your hair and brush it Now you're going to want to start all the way at the back and take about a half inch, mm, about an inch, tuck that behind your ear and comb that straight up. And if, like you're going to comb it straight up because we're going to tease it, but for a lot of height you kind of want to comb it forward so it's more at an angle than we are. So it's forward, not straight up, forward. And you're just going to back comb that. And spray that with a little bit of hairspray. And then you're going to take another inch. And do the same thing making sure that you push it directly to your roots so you get the most lift and then spray that tease it, whichever y'all prefer to call it. I call it teasing it. I like that little shine. And then, I have bangs. Let me get this down. Like, short side bangs. So I'm gonna part those and then spray a little hairspray in them. And then brush that together. Tease that. Maybe. Huh. And then spray that. And kind of just go through and comb and kind of blend it in. I kind of want to have it straight back. And then take your bob. Oh, yeah, you need bobby pins. Mm -hmm. Take your bobby pin. Let me see how much time I have left. Okay. Take your bobby pin. If I can find one. Alright, I can't find my bottom pins. I must put them somewhere. So I'm just going to use a hair tie. And if you were using bobby pins, just kind of bobby pin it in to the base of the last ponytail. But if you don't have it, just create a new ponytail. A real loose, loose, loose. And then, burn it. And it'll give you a 
they look like this. Let me show you. This is the front. And on this side, how it kind of like goes up like a mohawk. And then the back. And the other side. So that would be my rock star style. And it takes, I don't know, 10 minutes. <laughs> and um, that would be my rock star half mohawk -y ponytail. Um, I wear this out sometimes, but I like to kind of tease it up a little bit higher. But since I'm just kind of showing you the gist of it, that's how I would do it. Let me show you the back one more time. How it just bumps up right here and then kind of creates a line going down like a mohawk. And on the side. And I just think it's a nice, fun way to kind of do a mohawk without cutting your hair. And that's kind of my little rock style look. I think it's cute. Tell me what y'all think. Leave comments in. Like Bev always says, rock on.